This is Joseph Martin. Welcome to Worship Songs, Spring 2023. You have just heard Ride On King Jesus, an anthem for Palm Sunday. It's my own reimagining of a classic spiritual. This new hymn arrangement is a festive start to our new promotion featuring music from the composers and writers of Hal Leonard, Shawnee Press, Fred Bach Music, and Henshaw Publications. To get the most of these Worship Songs excerpts, you may want to download our Worship Songs magazine. There you will find more useful information about the featured anthems, along with product lists and alternate voicings. Also remember, with just a few clicks, you can look and listen to all these great anthems in their entirety on our Hal Leonard Shawnee Press YouTube site. Now, here's Sue Martin to take us through the new release. Sue on with the music. Heather Sorensen delivers a highly creative interpretation of a classic hymn with Near the Cross. Jesus, keep me near the
Karen Crane and Joel Rainey team up for a joyful new anthem celebrating the blessings of the Lord. Here is My God is Good. I am weak, but God is strong. God is strong. Pamela Stewart and Brad Nix are on point with their latest collaborative effort. Enjoy their hopeful message in music. Jesus rolled the stone away. Stunning a cappella hymn arrangement from David Angerman reminds us of the deep beauty found in our legacy of hymns. Here is Beautiful Savior.
Victor Johnson invites the church to celebrate the risen Savior in his setting of a Roger Thornhill lyric. Listen to an Easter exclamation. a scripture-based anthem from the prolific pen of Joseph Martin. Here is A Good Work. The one who began a good work in you, the Lord and creator of all that is true, will keep every promise and carry them through. The one who began a good work in you. A truly timeless truth is presented in Phil Hayden's thoughtful new anthem, Where Compassion and Love Abound. Drennan is at her best in this tender, multi-generational anthem that reminds us of the simple beauties of our lives. Through the Eyes of a Child Jesus loves me this 
Jonathan Martin and Lloyd Larson combined to deliver a lilting affirmation to the spirit-filled life. Here is Spirit of Joy. Spirit of joy, spirit of worship, move throughout your church today. Spirit of hope, spirit of freedom, show us now your truth and your way. Spirit of joy, spirit of gently touches a treasured spiritual with thoughtful craftsmanship and sincerity of purpose with his octavo, I want Jesus to walk with me. I want Jesus to walk with me. Once again, Heather Sorensen delights us with her wide range of musical styles. Lifting the voice of praise, here is Come Sing Unto Our God.
light and bright, Patricia Mock's cheerful song celebrating the glory of creation is a one rehearsal wonder that will be an instant favorite with your choir and congregation. In Everything Fair. In everything fair. In everything rare. Creation reflects all the Father's great care. The stars that dazzle in the night, the golden hope of morning's light. Each day a celebration of new life. Diane Hannibal always crafts such beautiful melodies, and many of her anthems spring directly from Scripture. Consider her latest, Fear Not, For I Have Redeemed You. Fear not, for I have redeemed you. I have called you by name. Take a walk down memory lane in our next medley of classic hymns, a true potpourri of praise. Enjoy Joseph Martin's happy new octavo, Melodies of Love. I have a song that Jesus gave me. It was sent from heaven above. And ever was a sweet
John Levitt provides a new choral piece that is artful and useful, ideal for the beginning of the Lenten season. Consider now, Lord, who throughout these 40 days. Lord, who throughout these 40 days for us with fast and pray, teach us with you to Graceful and honest, here is a hopeful song that reminds us that God is the great healer and comforter. Broken and Beautiful by Heather Sorensen and Joseph Martin. Composer David Bales brings us a lilting song of grace that is especially useful for communion services. Here is, Come, Taste the Joy of the Lord. The table is set, the meal is prepared. Rich pleasures await that have no compare. His goodness is free. Restored, come taste the joy of the Lord. 
Composer John Benke always delights the ear and impacts the heart with his choral offerings. Let's listen to his latest sanctuary creation, O Spirit of God. O Spirit of God, through time unending me, to us a source of strength, our comfort in me. Stacy Nordmeyer takes the words of Roger Thornhill and lifts them in a jubilant celebration. For Palm Sunday, here is Prepare the Palms of Praise. Familiar hymn tune is reimagined and set soaring for Resurrection Sunday by composer John Page. A true celebration, consider, rejoice for Jesus is risen. Rejoice for Jesus is risen, the snow has been rolled away. The chains of death have been broken, our
ministry and artistry mingled together, Jesus will remain. Written by Amber Maxwell, arranged by Heather Sorensen. a true sacred evergreen with Patty Drennan's new arrangement, Revive Us Again. treasured truth for our troubled times. Lee and Susan Dangler's worshipful choral prayer, Give Your Children Peace.
Pamela Stewart and John Purifoy collaborate frequently on anthems for the church. They never fail to inspire and encourage. Based on a well-known tune, consider their latest creation, Life is Born Again. Now the rains are ended and the winter past. It's the time of singing. draws into focus the power of community, service, and unity. John Levitt brings us, Let Us Talents and Tongues Employ. of Gethsemane is on full display with Joseph Martin's expressive choral tableau, Shadow Garden. With every breath of wind, the garden moves in whispered Jesus, as he breathes. 
For Transfiguration Sunday, ponder this inspiring new Diane Hannibal sacred choral work. Arranged by John Page, here is See the Brilliant Glow Before Us. See the brilliant glow before us. Jesus shines in bright array. On the mountain in His glory, light of God in full display. In a cloud of shining snow. Innovative and invigorating, Pepper Choplin brings us a scripture setting that will connect with the traditional, transitional church. He calls it simply Philippians 4. calls the listener to humbleness, repentance, and forgiveness. Vicki Smolik's moving on bended knee. Yet hard to forget, 
This next sacred choral winner is a great anthem for any occasion. Sing Joy, Make a Beautiful Noise by Michael Barrett. Sing joy, sing joy, make a beautiful noise, refreshing the hearts of the people. Sing joy, sing joy, lift a jubilant voice. It's a glorious day to celebrate praise, a wonderful day to sing praise. Sing love, sing love, the music of love, refreshing the hearts of the Christ's redemptive work on the cross is front and center in Heather Sorensen's arrangement of the highly poetic worship song, Wood and Nails. Oh, humble carpenter, down on your hands and knees. Look on your hands Resurrection Sunday is brilliantly announced in John Levitt's latest sacred choral work. Dazzling in its impact, listen to That Easter Day with Joy Was Bright.
Gilpin celebrates the many beauties of God's wonderful world in an anthem that is particularly useful for Environmental Awareness Sundays. Add purpose to your praise with Sing for the Earth. The Lord has birthed the bread. Honored Hymn is respectfully presented for choral forces by award-winning composer Robert Sterling. Here is his setting of Spirit of God, Descend Upon My Heart. Spirit of God, descend upon my heart. the dawn of risen glory with a dazzling anthem that will set your hearts soaring. Easter Bells Set Free Your Music by Stuart Harris. Easter Bells Set Free Your Music Chime with joy this sacred hour Holy shed o'er Alleluia's ring with resurrection power The Last Supper is the focus of Susan Dangler and Ken Litton's new poignant portrait of Grace, entitled, And It Was Evening.
emotion, here is To Follow Jesus by Amber Maxwell, arranged by Stacy Nordmeyer. I am resolved to follow Jesus along this path that points to Calvary. Though the cross may cost me everything, I hear him call, come for Next, we present an epic anthem that celebrates the mystery and majesty of God's joy and love for His people. Joseph Martin's God is Singing. Russell Floyd's music is perfectly joined with a thought-provoking Milburn Price text. The result is a sermon in song, reminding us that we are blessed to be a blessing. Listen to Take What I Give and Use It Well. Take what I give. Oh, uh-huh. 
Sorensen scored a winner with the next contemporary call to service. Incorporating a well-loved spiritual, this octavo is so engaging. Give me a song. Jesus, give me a song. Feature Cantata for Spring, From Silence to Song by Joseph Martin. This chamber cantata for Holy Week or Easter provides for two endings, optimizing performance offerings, from ministry to humility, Calvary to victory. The story of Christ's redemptive grace is told in song and scripture-based narration. A smaller yet effective orchestration from Ed Hogan provides instrumental or track options, while voice-dominant downloads make learning convenient and approachable. Let's listen to some excerpts from Joseph Martin's From Silence to Song.
Next, we have a new edition of our popular choral collection, Simple Songs for Slim Sundays. In this second volume, we have assembled a variety of traditional styled options for directors looking to stretch their budget and minimize their rehearsal times. From festive rhythmic praise anthems to expressive sacred songs of reflection, this collection will be your go-to volume when you need something special, but time is short. Here are some excerpts from Simple Songs for Slim Sundays, Volume 2. Awake, awake, a joyful song, born to Christ, so raise and love. Let every heart and every tongue praise the one eternal word. Sinners awake and turn to Jesus. Awake, awake, a joyful song to
Our next cantata is a true classic from the pen of composer John Levitt. 
Rich with expressive beauty, this memorable work is replete with the composer's signature artistry. Reverently offered, this traditional styled cantata has been proven over and over again by church and seminary choirs. Here are some selective moments from John Levitt's The Lenten Canticles.
Victor Johnson and Joseph Martin offer an engaging new anthem that encourages seekers and reminds the worshiper of the faithfulness of God. Ideal for Lent, here is The Wilderness of Wandering. Fellowship and obedience is found in our next sacred publication. Heather Sorensen presents Fix Our Eyes. We run this race to win a crown. We lay aside the things that weigh us down. We will fix our eyes on you. From atop the contemporary Christian charts to the choir loft comes I Speak Jesus, arranged by Joseph Martin. I just want to speak the name of Jesus Over every heart and every mind Cause I know there is peace within your presence I speak Jesus I just want to speak the name of Jesus Till every dark addiction 
starts to break, declaring there is hope and there is freedom, I see Jesus. David Angerman is equally at home arranging contemporary music as he is with more traditional styled compositions. In our next anthem, he's able to meld these two styles together. Keith and Kristen Geddes, Christ Our Hope in Life and Death. What is our hope in life and death? Christ alone. From scripture comes a promise of life everlasting. Diane Hannibal at her writing best, here is I Prepare a Place, arranged for choir by Douglas Nolan. In my father's house are many rooms, I prepare a place for Thank you. 
And now, a very singular choral piece, written from the perspective of Mary, the mother of Christ. Beautiful and bittersweet, here is Herb Frombach and Joshua Metzger's anthem for Holy Week, Mary Knew. Beauty joins a message that is appropriate any time. Mary Ann Cooper and Barbara Furman present, I Will Trust in Christ Alone. Larson's new acclamation of purpose. Here is, We Are God's Servants. Oh 
A powerful new worship ballad provided by writers Joel Houston, Benjamin Hastings, and Dylan Thomas is adroitly set for choir by Heather Sorensen. No, you will. When the road runs dead, you can see a way I don't. And it makes no sense, but you say that's what faith is for. A promise. When I see a grave, you see a door, and when I'm at my end, you see where the future starts. I don't know how you make a way, but I know you will. I don't know how you make a way, but I know. Composer Phil Hayden delivers a gently rhythmic call to worship for the traditional, transitional church in his SAB anthem, I Will Awaken the Dawn. I will Michael Showalter and Joseph Martin visit the Gathering of Grace and the Heart of Worship with We Remember. 
Arranged by Heather Sorensen. I was lost in shame, could not get past my blame until he called my name. I'm so glad he changed me, darkness held me down, but Jesus pulled me out and I'm no longer bound. I'm so glad he changed me, see I'm now a new creation in Christ. The old has gone, there's new life I live by faith, not by sight Now let's listen to our classics for this edition of Worship Songs. These flashback anthems are among our most successful anthems of all time. Joseph Martin's award-winning Pieta draws its inspiration from Michelangelo's famous sculpture that shows Mary holding the slain Jesus in her arms. Here is an excerpt of Pieta.
From New Testament Scripture comes a life lesson set to song, Lee Dangler's best-selling, Think on These Things. Now back with our new anthems. Stan Pethel revisits a nostalgic gospel song that still speaks today. Enjoy, fill my cup, Lord. Like the woman at the well I was seeking For things that could not satisfy And then I heard my Savior speak Elaine Schramm is no stranger to our catalog, having provided many successful worship resources through the years. In this release, she and lyricist Bert Stratton collaborate on a very meaningful spiritual lesson in song. Here is Upon Your Potter's Wheel. Thank you. 
Enriched with a pleasing gospel lilt, John Banke gives us a fabulous choral for any occasion. We've come a long way, Lord. Walking, walking with my brother, walking, walking with my sister, walking, walking all together, step by step. We've come a long way, Lord, long way, a mighty long way. Now we present a Joseph Martin anthem that can be an enriching part of any worship gathering or sacred concert. Invitation to Grace. John Levitt just keeps writing with a true spirit of excellence. His sacred writing always speaks to the heart of the worshiper. Consider, in the cross of Christ I glory. In the cross of Christ I am. Oh, 
Ash Wednesday, you will find nothing more ideal than Stacy Nordmeyer's thoughtful anthem, Touch Me With Ashes. Touch me with ashes, teach me your way. Here in this silence, reach me, I pray. From the Christian country trio Kane comes the hit song, The Commission. Enjoy Ed Hogan's expert arrangement of this meaningful new song. See my hands and look at my feet. It's okay if it's hard to believe. I have faith that you will do great. It's my time to go, but before I leave, go tell the world about me. I was dead, but now I live. I've got to go. A beautiful ballad that is filled with promise and assurance. Travis Boyd at his creative best, God is there.
Listen now as David Schwebel delivers a song for seekers everywhere. This is the way. Mary McDonald touches a Stuart Hamlin classic as only she can. Listen to Until Then. My heart can see. Robust and energetic, Michael Ware's latest choral creation is instantly engaging. Available in two voicing options, here is Trusting in My Savior. Oh, Jesus, Savior, pilot me. I'm trusting in the Savior. Over all of life's tempestuous sea. I am trusting in the Savior. Unknown waves before me roll. I'm trusting in the Savior. Waves that hide the rocks and treacherous shore. I am trusting in the Savior. Trusting in the Savior. Oh, I'm trusting in the Savior. When the storms of life blow strong and cold, I am trusting in the Savior. The boisterous winds obey your will. I'm trusting in the Savior. When you say unto them, peace be still, I am trusting in the Savior. Trusting in the Savior, oh, I'm trusting in the Savior. 
When the storms of life blow strong and cold, I am trusting in the Savior. And when at last I near the shore, I'm trusting in the Savior. A Powerful Paean of Praise, Not Unto Us, by Heather Sorensen, is a moving testament to the majesty of Almighty God. Not unto us, but to your name be glory, and not for us, but for your sake, O oh Lord, we live this song. Inspired by a classic text, Tracy McGibbon and Stuart Harris express a spirit of sacred security in their anthem, Jesus, I Am Resting. So much i yeah. 
composer Sean Paul offers now a rhythmic call to praise with Hallelujah, Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, ye hands adore Him. Praise Him, angels in the height. Sun and moon rejoice before Him. Praise Him, all His stars and light. Praise the Lord, for He has spoken. World's His mighty voice obey. Laws which never shall be broken. For the guidance He has made. Now an anthem filled with gentle images of a loving God, Lord of love who shepherds me, speaks straight to the heart. The words and music are by Lynn German. Our Salate line of choral resources is designed to provide music to choirs of distinction. These artful creations feature leading composers who are challenging church choirs to reach for new levels of expression in their concert and worship presentations. Let's begin with Michael John Trotta's beautiful new choral creation, Open My Ears. This is a fresh addition to a new series of compositions. Let's listen.
It seems appropriate to also remind you of Michael's first anthem in this series of choral invocations, Open My Eyes. Now we welcome Brian Childers to our family of brands with a nuanced setting of the Latin text, Kyrie eleison. For Trinity Sunday, or concert usage, consider James Eakin's stellar new anthem simply titled, Holy.
like a shimmering star, Brad Nix's stunning anthem, Vox Spiritus, is a luminous offering for the season of Pentecost. classic sacred poem is given a magnificent new setting by Shelton Ridgelove. Experience, I see his blood upon the rose. I see his blood, I see his blood Now we continue with more new music for your worship planning. Here is a contemporary offering from arranger David Angerman. 
we come to you, Jesus. Our next anthem is sure to be a bestseller. The familiar melody, a Dvorak classic, becomes transformed for the sanctuary by composer-arranger Sean Paul. Here is Jesus, my song to you. Jesus, Jesus, lover of my soul. A beautiful folk song takes on new lyrics that reminds us of God's presence in our lives. Here is Garden of Prayer by Joseph Martin. There's a garden which Jesus is and the grace to 
the brim with vibrant joy, David Engerman brings us a magnificent choral version of Mac Powell's River of Life. Brothers, sisters, come on down to the river. Guaranteed you'll never be the same. There's a mountain flowing from the heart of the Savior. Bring your sins and all your guilty stains. Let that river of life wash it all away. Presented now with an expressive chamber orchestration, rediscover Brad Nix and Joseph Martin's Bring Me to the Cross. Bring me to From Herb Frombach and Stan Pethel comes a fresh approach to a classic spiritual truth. Here is What a Friend. Oh, 
Jennifer Klein brings us a prayer of serenity and peace in her latest choral creation. Here is Prayer for This House. this portion of worship songs, consider this meaningful benediction from Scripture. May the grace of Christ, by Joseph Martin. We are very pleased to present to you the new publications from the Fred Bach Music Company and Hinshaw Music, music of distinction and diversity. World-renowned composer Rosephany Powell has written a beautiful anthem for SATB Choir and Flute. Here's Blessed Are the Peacemakers by Rosephany Powell. Be called 
Peterson and Sherry Blevins provides us with an uplifting and accessible anthem entitled Lift Me for SATB Choir and Piano Accompaniment. I'm Patricia Mock has a new anthem of prayer called Precious Jesus, arranged so tastefully for SATB Choir and Piano by Richard A. Nichols. Precious Jesus, draw me near, help me rest each child and Jesus, Jesus. 
composer Mark Miller gives us a perfect anthem for Ash Wednesday. Easily accessible for adult or youth choirs, the piece is scored for mixed voices, soprano descant, piano, and optional congregation. has created so many great melodies in his composing career, but probably none are better than this new solo version of his classic anthem, The Prayer of St. Francis, available in high, medium, or low voice. Here is The Prayer of St. Francis by Alan Pote. Oh, Lord, make 
This may be the most versatile processional hosanna ever written. Easy to learn. Fun to use. Great for including the children's choirs with the adults at the beginning of the service. Written for two-part choir with keyboard. This is Hosanna by Christian Greger. Hosanna, loud Hosanna. Perfect for Lent, Holy Week, or any communion service, here is a new anthem by Thomas J. DeFeo, arranged for SATB choir and piano by Richard A. Nichols. This is Bread is Broken. Christ is risen. He is risen indeed. Feel the triumph of Easter with this rousing opening fanfare for SATB choir, congregation, organ, brass, and timpani. Fanfare and hymn for the risen Savior by Brian Jeffrey Leach and Alan Pote.
this classic Easter anthem has been elevated to dramatic regal status by Richard Nichols, with settings for SATB or SAB choir and organ, with optional brass and percussion, perfect for the Sunday after Easter or Christ the King Sunday. Here's Lift High the Cross by Richard Nichols. Lift high the cross, the love of Christ proclaim, till all the world adore His sacred name. Lift high the cross, Let's continue now with Shawnee's New Spring and Easter Music for Young Voices. For older elementary choirs, Shawnee Press presents an outstanding variety of New Worship Songs Junior Anthems for general and seasonal use, including Lent and Easter. First, an African Worship Song by Joseph Martin and John Paradowski is a sensational multicultural anthem perfect for use any time of the year. Written for children, youth, adults, and percussion instruments, this piece may be sung by one choir or multiple choirs combined for an intergenerational presentation. Two voicings are available, SATB, and unison optional two part choir. Na numa wai e na numa 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 Rhythmic energy fills this festive arrangement of Come Christians Join to Sing by Mark Patterson for unison, optional two-part choir, and piano. Precious choice, hallelujah. 
got the whole world in his hands, arranged by Stacy Nordmeyer, for unison, optional two-part choir and piano, combines the well-known spiritual with new music to all things bright and beautiful, creating a delightful partner song. He's got the whole world. Good Gifts by Dora Ann Purdy combines a beautiful 18th century text with a flowing new melody perfectly suited for unison, optional two-part choir, and piano. We plow the fields and scatter the good seed on the land, but it is fed and watered by God's almighty hand, who sends us no Jeff Reeves gives us a stirring new setting of Gracious Spirit Dwell With Me for unison optional two-part choir, piano, and optional chime tree or finger cymbals, ideal for Lent or any time of year. God of grace and compassion, show us how to love and help others, just as you love and help us each day.
God of truth and wisdom, create in us a clean heart and make our lives a reflection of your holiness. Truthful spirit dwell with me, I would truthful be. Help me now thy truth to see, oh I would be like thee. For older elementary choirs, Shawnee Press presents an outstanding variety of New Worship Songs Junior anthems for general and seasonal use, including Lent and Easter. In our new children's release is a victorious Easter anthem, Alleluia, His Praises We Sing. Written for unison, optional, two-part choir, this anthem provides the option for congregation to join the choir in singing a portion of Christ the Lord is Risen Today, written by Ralph Manuel and David William Hodges, arranged by Jeff Reeves. Our Savior rose today. Press honors the 10th anniversary of its outstanding series for sacred younger elementary choirs with its newest volume, Sing and Celebrate 10. This special multi-purpose volume contains music for two mini musicals, one for any general season of the year and one for Christmas. Each mini musical provides five songs with age-appropriate scripts, plus flexible suggestions for sets, props, staging, costumes, and cast assignments. The songs in each mini musical may also be sung separately as individual anthems throughout the year. Lesson plans are provided for each song with additional teaching material and audio tracks available through online download. Enjoy these excerpts from this newest volume in the Sing and Celebrate series. God made the light, the moon and the stars, the sun shining bright, the land and the seas, the mountains and trees. God made it all and said, I am pleased.
made for sharing. On this we can agree. We all are God's creation, one special family. The valleys need the mountains, the ocean needs the sand, and people need each other to lend a helping hand. Joseph, come travel with us to Bethlehem as we tell the story about the greatest gift of all. Donkey, donkey, clip, clop, clip, clop. Donkey, donkey, do not stop. It was night, but God put a special star in the sky to guide us on our way. happened. Jesus, God's Son, was born and came to earth. <laughs> 